Hey everybody, welcome back. Claudie13 here, and we are back with Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII Reunion. And, uh, this is part... Uh, I don't even remember anymore. Uh, I want to say 17, I think. But, uh, yeah, I, uh... Better come in and record today, and, uh... Let's mosey, shall we? Um... I don't even remember what I was doing. It's been about a week since I played, so... I know Cloud and, uh, Cloud's not looking too good, and... I'm still amazed at how large of a person Zack is comparatively to, like, Tifa and Cloud. It's kind of stupid. He's really large for some reason. Sephiroth, where did you go? <sighs> what happened? Uh, sorry, I can't say. I thought so. A lot of shrugging going on. A lot of, a lot of one I'll of ask these. The townspeople <laughs> about Sephiroth. Thank you, Tifa. Cloud looks like shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm still like amazed that she doesn't know it's him. I mean, you'd think he would. You know, there'd be some sort of hair. You could see his face from under the mask, but apparently not. Tifa's safe. Don't worry. If only I were a soldier. I don't think that would make a difference, dude. <sighs> Zack? Soldier is like a den of monsters. Don't go inside. What happened? I don't know, man. I thought I knew, but... Ah. Uh... By the way, do you know Tifa? Sort of. Talk to her? No. I'm sensing some issues here. Shouldn't you do something? I'm one to talk. I'm with soldiers, so fighting's all I do. Sorting things out is someone else's job. What's going on? Who's the enemy? It makes no difference to me! Don't be smashing the beds up, man. <laughs> Hey, Zack, I really like that sword. It's impressive. Well, you better get used to it. <laughs> Use brings about wear, tear, and rust. And that's a real waste. You're a little more important than my sword. But just a little. <laughs> Embrace your dreams. And, whatever happens, protect your soldier honor. This is a symbol of my dreams and honor. No, it's more. Weighs That's like 150 right. pounds. I had almost forgotten. Thank you, Cloud. Huh? I'm gonna crash. Night. I guess he figured it all out. <laughs> oh, we slept in an inn, huh? Well, that was kind of neat. <laughs> I think it's the only time that happens in this game. I don't remember you resting at all. Like, in hearing the, like... Usually there's, like, a jingle that plays in Final Fantasy games and just... Surprised, uh, hadn't heard it. 
Is that Tifa? No. No way. It's a sad painting. And also kind of eerie. Are we in the Shinra Mansion? Or are we just in the... Are we in the inn? I don't even know. Oh, why do I have her email address all of a sudden? That's weird. Come over to my house. I want you to try my mom's cooking. The thing is, I haven't been home yet since I've been here. I hadn't been able to make up my mind about it. But I decided that I should show my face. But going home alone is a bit uncomfortable, so I was hoping you could join me. So that's from Cloud. And then Tifa's asking if the guy's all right, because apparently she can't figure out who it is somehow. I don't know, I could see under the other dude's mask from the last video, uh, one of the other soldiers, so I don't know. Or one of the other uh, infantrymen. I don't know, she can't see him at all under that thing? Uh, Sephiroth is at Shinra Manor. Are you talking about that big mansion? Uh, yes. Shinra's owned it a long time. Okay, see ya. <laughs> All right. Red leather. Uh, someone like a Genesis fan club. Freaking weird. <laughs> All right, grab a quick save. We're not doing mission savers. We're going through story now. I may, like I said, I may do some more later on down the line, and I may do like a bonus episode where we um. We tackle some of the harder fights in the... Like, there's some secret bosses, I think. But, after this game's done, I will go through the rest of the missions and try and power up as much as possible. And then potentially do that uh, bonus video where I take out some of the harder stuff. Hello? Aerith? I finally got through. Yeah. The friggin' flip phone. <laughs> uh, listen. Now's not the best time. I'll call you later. No, no. Two screens? That was know. like the, you know, that was the jam. Okay. Back in circa 2001. You had two screens, or like. I promise. You were, you were, uh. You were winning. <laughs> that way you didn't have to pull out the. You used to have to pull out your phone to check the time on the flip phone, but if you had two screens, you could just look at the top and just get your clock that way. Aerith, I'll be back soon. Okay, so that's not Cloud's mom. This is some weird we person. The Shinra Army. Oh yeah, this woman's weird. Forgot about that. She's the only one out there saying that. That's not Cloud, is it? To yeah, get it to is. Shinra Manor, go up the stairs ahead, then go. Oops. I'll show you. He'll show me. What are you doing, man? I heard that the hero Sephiroth was coming, so I've been waiting here all day with my camera. You're pointing at a wall. I want to take a picture of Sephiroth fighting a monster. I'm going to miss the decisive moment. Yeah, well, you're probably either going to miss the decisive moment or you're going to die trying, so... I don't need to save, I just saved. Activating combat mode. Paranoid. Come here, yo! That was quick. Oh yeah. Uh Kunzel, message for you. Yeah, so basically saying that the, the Turks are guarding Aerith, which is kinda probably part of their job and also kinda Sung's doing Zack a solid, I guess. Stop mailing me! Freaking bombs. So yeah, I'm still working through uh, the Final Fantasy games. I beat Final Fantasy 3, which was my first time going through that. Uh, original 3 as a pixel remaster, not... U.S. Final Fantasy 3, which was actually 6. Um, first time beating 3, I'm now on 4, and I'm going to keep working my way up until I get to... Um, I'm going to probably replay 15, because I played that uh, a couple years ago. Because I'm trying to get ready for June when 16 comes out. Not like I have to do this, I just kind of want to. 
Uh, it also gives me a chance to go through some of the older ones I haven't, so that's always cool. Sephiroth is in the second floor room, on the right. Thanks for the detailed, uh, location, Cloud. Stop mailing me. I can fight two. Are there any blonde guys in Soldier? Not a one. <laughs> Of any girl would love to have a blonde soldier guy protect her when she's in a pinch. Basically waiting for Cloud to come back someday and maybe can't <laughs> yet. Because he didn't make it into soldier. Hello again, Zach. Oh, oh wait, wait. Luci Lu Lucier? Is that one of the um the 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 soldier guys, like the third classes? <laughs> I don't remember. I wish I knew the combination of that safe. Stop. Yeah, don't tell anyone to ask about the blonde guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop mailing me. Look through the keyhole? I didn't I don't think I looked through this one. And there's nothing. There's a book. I still don't know where this frigging key is. Or the, um, the combination is. The underground passage door was unlocked. Maybe Sephiroth went underground? You know, I really should check out, uh, some of these, like, bookshelves and stuff. That passcode might be kicking around here somewhere. Go deep in underground caverns. We don't come across Vincent's little doorway, do we? I knew it. Uh. Coffin key obtained. Really? It's from killing that one guy? This is a little bit more creepier than, uh, well, original Final Fantasy VII, you go down like a spiral uh, staircase made of like wood. I don't remember if that's here or not, but activating combat mode. Taking you down a pit. This is gonna sting. Conflict resolved. All right. Activating combat mode. I just turn it down a little bit for myself. This gives it uh, pretty freaking loud. Where'd you go? Oh, you bitch! I keep getting coffin keys. Is there like a bunch of coffins down here? This isn't the... Oh yeah. So technically you would think Vincent would be in here, right? In the original game. Can I talk to one of them? It won't open. Are you telling me that this coffin needs a key? It would have been cool if he actually made a cameo. I don't think he does. Oh, it's just shitty bugs. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. No. No. There's only two that open, I guess. It won't open. Activating combat mode. Out of the way. Or is he put in here later? No, he wouldn't be put in here later because that wouldn't make sense. Is that it? I can't open anymore. I feel like that was kind of pointless. Unless there's more than one area. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. I guess so. How many of these are gonna be freaking beetles? It won't open. <sighs> Who's that? So he does make a cameo in a sense. Fast asleep. That's kind of funny though. 
I should probably leave him alone. He just was just out cold. That's kind of cool, though, that you get to uh, at least see him in a way. In a way. He won't open. Friggin' beetles. Activating combat mode. I think I remember coming across this when I uh, played the original on the PSP. Like, you, you could see Vincent, but not really. He's one of my favorite characters, so that's that's pretty cool that he at least gets a, like a little nod. Some uh, random bones, great. All right. There's no unfinished business unless there's uncompleted missions. I have a bunch of uncompleted missions, but I'm not at the level that I can do them. So anything at seven stars, like stupidly hard right now, so I'm going in. Excavated from a 2,000-year-old rock layer, a life form in stasis. Professor Gast named this life form Genova, I see. M-E-G-L 7-7-1977 Genova verified as an ancient. M-E-G-L 9-13-1977 Genova project approved. Mako Reactor 1 authorized for use. My mother's name, Genova. The Genova project is a coincidence. No. <laughs> Professor Gast, why didn't you tell me? Why did you die? You're telling me he thought he was normal this whole time? He never had any questions, and now he this is what makes him lose his mind. Leave me be. Okay. <laughs> Don't need to ask more than once. But I think that's all he says. From that day, Sephiroth shut himself inside Shinra Manor. And continued to review documents like a man possessed. The lights in the basement never went out once. There's a lot of pondering going on. And on the seventh day, he lit everything on fire. Like an asshole. You don't even know it's him yet. I mean, unless you've played the original game. But it, it was clearly him, because uh, who else would it be? Cloud didn't do it. In fact, I think his ass is right here. Sephiroth. He's just down for the count. Yes, I'm coming for you. This is what happens when you don't get any sleep for seven days. And you're reading a bunch of creepy ass books in a freaking abandoned manor. Man, that, that like upscaled PSP cutscene, it, it looks okay, but there's still a little bit of like, uh, what do they call them? Um, artifacts going on. Little blockies. How could you still a fantastic remake though. That's a, that's a very How small gripe you? on an awesome, awesome remake. Alright, I don't think I have anything to do here, and of course I can't do anything else anymore really, so this is, uh... We're on our way. I know there is another point in the game where you can, I think, go back to doing missions, but I think they were just kind of warning you that you're not going to be able to do them for a while. Death Claws. It's funny, because the Death Claws in this game almost look exactly like they do in the original Final Fantasy III. Because when I was playing through that game, I saw them and I was like, Oh my god, that little pixel version looks exactly like the one from Crisis Core. 
They don't always look that way. They kind of um, differ between games. Yeah, it's freaking C. Alright, let's get up here. New, new mail from Cloud. He was just face down in the dirt. How is he sending me a text message? Sephiroth set the whole village on fire. It's even her dad went chasing after him. You've got to stop them. Activating combat mode. Damn it! Here we go. Oh no, you don't. Sweet. Back up. Oh, yeah. Plus plus Resolve. mastered. I don't know how much that brings me up, but it's probably significant. It brings me up 26 points. I can't complain about that. Activating combat mode. Conflict resolved. Activating combat mode. Oh my god. Can you knock it off? Oh, I'm stopped. Crap. Heads up! This is gonna sting! Holy crap, they were beating the piss out of me. Like, more so than normal. Seriously, tell me I can't do missions and I can still access the menu? I can still do missions. What is it talking about? Was it just for that cutscene? Because that's stupid. <laughs> Apparently, I could do them right now if I wanted to. I'm not, but. Like I said, I'll probably do a bonus episode later on after the game's over and, like, uh, potentially, you know, fight some of those secret bosses or whatever. Did Sephiroth do this to you? But we still have a little bit of ways to go. Hate you, Shinra, soldier, and you. I hate you all! Oh, he's pissed. You can do more Sephiroth limit breaks because he killed a bunch of people in town. Mother, let's take back the planet together. I, I I've lost it. <laughs> Let's go to the promised land, Mother. Sephiroth! Why did you kill the townspeople? Why did you hurt Tifa? Answer me, Sephiroth! <laughs> Mother, they're here again. You should have ruled this planet. You were stronger. Smarter. But then they came. Those inferior dullards. They came and took this planet away from you. But don't be sad, Mother. I am with you now.
Great. We meet at last, mother. He's like, I'm totally unfazed by what you look like in there. Sephiroth, what the hell happened to you? Sephiroth, I trusted you. Now, technically, you would think Zack is more than strong enough to take him out. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I was getting bitched by Death Claws, so <laughs> maybe not. He acts like that Buster Sword weighs like 10 pounds. He did bulk up a little bit from like the beginning of the game. I thought that was a nice little touch. I don't know if they, uh, they always showed his hair changing, but. Activating combat mode. Whoa, that was long range. Don't be cutting any cannons in half. Apparently Sephiroth can teleport. Up a little bit. This'll do. That's enough. I missed two of those attacks completely. Oh, he can spin around mid draw. That's stupid. <laughs> I'll give you a taste of your own I'm medicine. Great. Heads up. Oh come on! I went, I went to go friggin' do my whole uh, Buster Sword mode or whatever, and he, he was like, "I'm gonna hit you real hard." I <laughs> uh, wasn't too bad. I'm waiting for him to like Take give me a moment here. You don't. Take that. Oh, he does not like that. Run for it. He was getting like damaged pretty good by the uh Thundaka blade. That's probably gonna do about, I don't know, 1400 if I don't block it. Maybe a bit more. I'd still rather block it. Okay. Enemies with one blow. Pretty seen this. I wish I could take him out with um, one blow, but that's not gonna happen. Concentrate. I'm feeling it. Come on, that was bullshit. He can pull that thing off real quick. That wasn't too bad either. Let's drop one of those. Summon my ass! Oh, he's got crystals now. It's a weird summon. <laughs> oh, I'm getting hurt. Here we go. Oh no, you don't! I need to heal up. Something's happening that's not good. That was gonna blow up. 
Now. Oh, that was close. I don't like Heartless Angel. I don't know why he can all of a sudden Bring do that shit. Guns. This isn't Kingdom Hearts, bitch. Prove your honor to me. That really freaking hurt. Four thousand damage. Here we go. This'll do. Come here, bitch. Heads up. Gonna love this. As long as he doesn't do Heartless Angel again, I'm, I'm fine. struck this planet. Your ancestors survived somehow by scurrying and hiding in fear. This is a new one. The planet was saved through the sacrifice of the Setra. After which, your kind would multiply as if nothing happened. Meanwhile, the Setra now only exists with the I'm just listening the to this. Species. So, what exactly does that have to do with you? Don't you see? We have the ancient, called Genova, unearthed from a 2,000-year-old stratum. And we have the Genova Project. The goal of the Genova Project was, in essence, to create a human being possessing the great powers of Acetra. Thus, they created me. Warm-up's over! Still, concentrate. <laughs> he hadn't lost his mind right there yet, it seems. Complete result. See, look, I beat his ass for now. No, you're not. You're not the Sephiroth I once knew. I am the chosen one. I have been chosen to rule this planet. <laughs> Do I have to do a squat competition with him? Oh, come on. This is going to suck. I'm gonna piss. I don't think so. Steffi Roth and me, come on. You don't. I do not want to be on the other side of this ledge. I don't know what this is gonna do, but I haven't seen Phoenix yet, so. 
That's freaking awesome. Holy crap. Now what happens? <clears throat> I just lose and he walks away with his big shoes. Alright, uh, I don't see a problem here with fighting him. It's just blocking all his shit, because that's what's pushing me to the edge. Alright, enough with the enough with the cutscenes. Activating combat mode. How about this? This is gonna sting. Here we go. Gonna love this. Taking you down. Oh no, you don't. Knock it off. Stop it. Oh my god, dude. All right, give me this lucky star shit. You can no. Oh, come on. He's like dead. Come on. He was so close. You gotta be kidding me! I don't want to freaking restart from the point of the battle. Okay, so apparently I'm gonna see if I can just spam Thundaga Blade until he dies or dies. Get knocked all the way across the room. I really wish. Come on, dude. Brace yourself. You can do it. Screw 
you, Sefi. The goofy ass face I just made. <laughs> he cut my hair. <laughs> Zach, what the hell, man? Ah, uh, that sucks. All of that sucked. He just totally wiped himself on those stairs. <clears throat> I mean, that's kind of cool looking. <laughs> I don't know why he was turning to dust when he got stabbed. That was weird. <laughs> it was a little bit more intense than that, if I remember correctly. He's not dead. But you stabbed him with that huge meat cleaver, and somehow his spinal cord is still intact. Sephiroth off. Kill this man. <laughs> I'm surprised he can lift that thing with his like current strength, but Sephiroth. Cut the doorway. <laughs> Holy shit. Yep. Yeah. Why? What's with the dust? That's so strange. It's like they're censoring it without censoring it. It's weird. Test me. No, impossible. Yeet. <laughs> Just yeeted Sephiroth into the friggin' depths. Yeah, I mean, you did get stabbed. Why would you just leave the Buster Sword there? I'd use it to walk. The thing's, like, huge. Use it as, like, a walking stick. Okay. <laughs> What's up, buddy? You did it. <clears throat> so, you never actually see in this, you don't see Sephiroth fall to his death. But in the original game, not this, not the PSP of this game, but the original Final Fantasy VII, this you see him here. fall into the Mako liquid. Intriguing. Most there you intriguing. didn't see shit. You just you saw darkness. It's with like subject. when Palpatine gets thrown off the friggin' thing in Star Wars. <laughs> One of those 90s movies deaths for <laughs> villains. 80s and 90s. All right, save game. That was a pain in the ass, but uh, like I said, you know, I persevered. Honestly, I should probably be a higher level and everything and have better, sh better shit. But like, I don't know. I kind of enjoyed the challenge a little bit, even though he was a 
Oh, son of a bitch. You call yourself soldier? You tarnish the soldier name. And deal! Put him in the bubbly liquid. Wait! wings I want them too generic scientist man enters the shot That's not, that shouldn't be as funny as it is. <laughs> oh. Cloud. Well, that is going to be it for today's video of Crisis Core. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I really appreciate it. Sorry about my little rage-inducing moment with Sephiroth, but uh, it's really pissing me off. Uh, I don't like when there's a boss battle with, like, a dumbass gimmick like that. But, like I said, we persevered, so that's good. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, if you like my content, you like my commentary, feel free to like the video. Uh, leave a comment down below, say hi if you feel like it, and uh, don't forget to subscribe because that keeps you in the know when I make new content. Thank you very much, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Catch you later.